this time on Universal Confusion Podcast. It's warm outside, you know, the seasons are changing and the stuff. The seasons you are know? changing. That's a great segue into today's topic, which is favorite bugs. seasons. Bugs. No, no, not bugs. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I like spring. Uh, yeah. Justin's coming up with great business ideas for winter, which no one likes. <laughs> uh, not your ideas. Your ideas are great. The w- winter. winter. It'd be summer, though. Okay. I'm just giving you a cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> I was on the edge of my was, every yeah, yeah, time. Every- Welcome back to another episode of Universal Confusion Podcast. Aaron's back. Aaron. Oh, I was gone. You were you were not here. Who do you? Who do you? Oh, yeah. I forgot. I forgot you forgot you weren't me. here? Yeah. I forgot, man. <laughs> God, it's just so natural. I just all the days just run by together. So yep. no, nope, been there, done that. Hit that time warp again. I guess. Oh, uh, in that time warp. I forgot how bright it was in here, though. It's as bright as it's ever been. I forget every time I leave here. Yeah, I come back, and so I guess if I do miss uh, a time, you know, I come back and it's super bright. So seems Thanks more bright than you recall. And I know that we have issues with flies that come back to life in here because, you know, everything's so bright Amazingly, and warm. Amazingly, last couple, when you weren't here, we had no flies. I'm, so I'm here. I, I think he's yeah. bringing them. It's warm outside, you know, the seasons are changing and the stuff. The seasons are know? changing. That's a great segue into today's topic, which is favorite bugs. seasons. Bugs. No, no, not bugs. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about bugs. Favorite bugs. Favorite bugs. I'm a Beatles kind of guy yeah. myself. I'm the the guy. Oh, yeah, I like the dude, bugs that rock. come back to life yeah. in this room. So. <laughs> the zombie flies. Yeah. Fly Seasons. apocalypse. Seasons. Yeah. Things you put on food. Nope, that's seasonings. Um, <laughs> different topic altogether. Seinfeld. Nope. I don't know if I had a bad season. I, they did. <laughs> I don't think they did, but also not what we're talking about. Curb Your Enthusiasm is in its last season. The last the last season of Seinfeld sucked because I was just cliffhanger, you know what I mean? Didn't know what was coming next. Yeah, I hate when that happens. No closure. Are you talking about weather? We're talking about weather season. No, dude. Yeah, we're like, talking about weather today. Yeah, yeah. it's a weather podcast. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yep. And where we live, uh, there's four seasons. Yep. You need a radar. We need on, a live yeah, radar. You, live six. weather there's radar six. right now, buddy. Well, yeah, you could argue six, there's six, but six because we're fall spring. That's where we're at right now. Right. Yeah. But you have the possibility of running into all of the seasons in the same day, which yeah, is always exciting. Too. That is fun. I've had air conditioning and heat on in the same day. Yeah. So Dale's favorite is winter. He just no. he loves it. <laughs> like the worst. The, who invented winter? Whoever decided like invented just, winter. Yeah. Those, came, those words came out of your mouth. Yeah. Who invented winter? Somebody did. I what is it? Is it Harp? Uh, is that be Harp, guy. right? That's who, who controls he the weather. Rick isn't it? Flair, the isn't nature it Harp? boy. <laughs> <Is> that- <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Fuck Rick Flair. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And winter. And Harp. Yeah. yeah. Harp. Yeah. Harp controls the weather, so they they yeah, invented winter. Yeah, it does a little bit there. I think there's some. Yeah. You know. It's that weather control, you know. They need to control it to 75 degrees year round, it's, mild, yeah. no wind, perfect. Yes. Yeah. I need you to set the atmospheric temperature <laughs> at a steady 74 degrees. Now, I am not expecting each of us to have a different opinion on this because no one likes winter. But That sounds like Aaron I, liked winter. It, he might. I like winter. I might be putting words in your mouth. I, you Nobody's around. Me. It's quiet. Okay. No one's out. Stay home. It's cold. Do your thing. Nah, I just, that's when I'm out, you know? Sucks. You got to put a bunch of yeah. clothes on. Now I can go out and enjoy the the, the the sights and everything, and there's nobody around. Nobody wants to be out there when it's Yeah, crazy. but you're in a bunch of clothes. Like, it ruins everything. Not bad. Just, you know, clothes are the move worst around a little bit, ever. you know? Dude, that's what I don't get. Like, Especially people at night. in the Midwest, <laughs> if you don't like the winter, get out. There you go. That is true. That's a good point. Art, I for, mean, like, art for poor people, Justin. That's <laughs> hey, people Although in the Midwest are who are here. poor, stop being fucking poor. <laughs> great, great, great advice. advice. If you want to uh, enjoy better weather, stop yeah. being poor. Justin and now, the more you people. know. <laughs> Send us your Venmo. Justin will make donations to your yeah, cause. Absolutely. Justin hates poor people. <laughs> That's what the name of it will also, be. Also, winter. He's, the Justin hates poor people fund. Donate. <laughs> I personally like spring myself. Spring and fall are kind of my jam because summer can get oh, too yeah. hot, winter for sure too cold. Um, 
I like spring over fall, though, because when you go from being real cold, then it warms up a little bit. And I'm saying like 55, 60. It's like a heat wave, and it feels good after the long winter. Yeah, when you go from true. summer into fall, and you get down into like that 55, 60 range, it feels cold because you're used to the hotter weather. So if I had to pick, I'd say those two are my favorite. If I had to pick one, I'd probably say spring. You like to flow up Correct. instead of flowing down, bro. Correct. I feel you. I feel you. Well, it just feels better. No, I got you because, yeah, you're right. During like the same part of the day, sometimes you can mistake that early spring day as like a fall day. You know, it's like there's still no leaves. You know, it's like if I was to close my eyes right now, it could be like late October or something. Yeah, but you're used to the cold, so the little bit of yeah. extra warmness. But then it trails back off again, you know what I mean? You get those warm early spring days, and it's cold in the morning, and it gets warm, and then by night it's fucking cold. Oh, you got to love like the 30, 40 degree yeah, swing you're days. More, yeah, yeah. You're, more on a, you're more on a this level on those days than you are on just I mean, a flow yeah, down. We're in that, you know? that mode now, apparently. Oh, yeah. Yeah, times have been Which, swinging pretty I good. I mean, it sucks because business gets slow, but well, I'll take the well, that in the sun angle starts to feel a little better. You start to get some of that warmth. More and, daylight. Yeah, yeah, more angularity. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I do. Yes, angularity. Less, Thank you. <laughs> more of an acute. Yeah. Or less you know, acute, it's a little acute. higher, you know. It doesn't, you know. Yeah. Nope, I totally agree. But, yeah. Yeah, that's me. I mean, I like. I think spring it's would be my jam if I had to pick something. Spring, if I could yeah. find somewhere about 70 to 75 all year round. You need to move to San Diego, bro. Yeah. That. There are places. That's not located in California. <laughs> right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't care gotta, how nice their weather yeah, are. Exactly. Well, just go buy multiple homes in different places and travel. You have to build an yeah. underground bunker, dude. That's what you got to do. That's there true, because then I could keep it whatever I want. It could be spring all the time. Build a big enough one, throw some sand in it and some water, some little beach noise thing. So mm -hmm. you, know, you got your beach in one room. You got your fall in the next room. You're going to have to have a walk-in freezer, so you got winter right there. Yeah, yeah. You can put a little snowboarding track in your freezer. Yep, yep, yeah. The kids can go in there and make snowmen and shit. You no, know, that's the biggest problem I have with winter, especially around snowmen? here. Snowmen? We don't get no fucking snow anymore. So No, we don't. It's cold and shitty, but there's nothing to do. Yeah. Just be cold. Negative 14, no, but no nothing sledding. to show for it. Can't, you know, yeah. nothing to do. I don't really like it. I don't see. I don't mind the no sledding. Sledding is miserable. <laughs> what do you mean? Ah, ah. You don't I'm like to walk back I up mean, the hill? You get, a, you get a flask of some whiskey or some... Don't like to walk up the hill. Tequila, I don't like to sit in there for hours watching the kids go up and down and up and uh, down. You're talking about them, not you actually sledding. Correct, yeah. I, mean, I couldn't tell you the last time I was oh, I like myself. Some, I, I like some snowboarding. I mean, I can't ever make it to the you bottom. You like falling off of a snowboard. fun, man. <laughs> I can't make it's it It's a bottom. good time. You just like falling. Okay. Yeah. Do you, I'll, I'll do you skateboard like... in the summer? Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> no. I have a feeling it'd be the same. I used Why to skateboard I when I was a kid, and it hurts. Yeah. yeah. I guess more than snow. Yeah. Of course, you get I on that up hard on pack gravel snow. road, so no, I wasn't <laughs> skateboarding. Did you try, though? Because that would have been hilarious. <laughs> yeah. No, nah, dude. Every time short I got rise, on man. a skateboard, yeah. I immediately <laughs> fell off. And I learned after, like, I don't know, maybe 10 times I was like, yeah, this isn't for me. Nope. Well, like literally would get on and it would just go away. Similar. Like, yeah. All right. I had a similar experience. Nope. I'll the, just ride a bike. The garage and apron were cement, but then that was only like 20 feet off the garage. And then after that, it was gravel driveway. Yeah. So, I mean, you really only had the garage, the apron, and then you had to jump off that skateboard before you hit that gravel because bad oh, things yeah. were coming. Stop. Yeah. 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 So that's, I think that's part of the reason I never got into skateboarding. I had a good spill one time. It's like cruising down like Cardinal, like before they redid it all when I was younger. And I was like, got some speed on the skateboard, man. And then there was like a lone rock, dude. Oh, yeah. I just somersaulted off that thing yeah, those, on the road, dude. Just like those little wheels don't handle rolling around, man. No, the rain oh, very dude. well. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't like a gravel road or nothing, it was actually a pretty smooth road. But there was just a, a lone, uh, you know. And then you're just on gravel, the piece of gravel, and then you're just one up, one rock. If one rock can ruin your day, I'm yeah, not interested. I know, dude. And I was like, nah, 
probably don't want to do now this. Now they got no those more. fucking weird one wheel hoverboards you can like go through the woods on. And shit. Yeah. <laughs> Does it have <laughs> lasers? Have lot, if yeah. it had lasers, I'd get one. I'm of sure those. you could put some lasers. Yeah, in. I don't trust AI, Maybe. so I would never own one of those. I don't, it's not, I don't think it's AI. Similar. <laughs> it will be. <laughs> <laughs> and all of a sudden, you're like, oh, this is a really fun track. And the next thing you know, it's like, Going to destination. Right. Yeah. Oh shit! Locks With your, your feet. feet in. In. Yeah. yeah. You're done. Yeah. You just fall down. It's just dragging you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it just <laughs> stops real fast. You know. You're like, oh. You're just oh, getting you're drugged behind the single tire. Yeah. Oh, the correcting platform it just snaps your ankles. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Now we can go. Ah. Oh, dude. This back there over <laughs> rough terrain, <laughs> dude. Yeah. So fuck AI. Beating against trees and shit. <laughs> okay. Then it Making just takes off and through, flies, through, through dude. Through One wheel. It, it takes you way up in the sky. Dude. It's got like rockets that come out. Then it just lets go of you. Then you just fall. Yeah, and for yeah. anyone wondering what this has to do with the seasons, you can't ride one of those in the winter, so clearly this has yeah. everything yeah. to do with you seasons. You know, if they were smart, they'd build one that was like tank tread style, and then you could okay. yeah. put <laughs> some skis good. on the outside <laughs> of it. It'd be wider, but, you know, you Tracks could tread it. On your like a mono board. snowmobile. Yeah, dude, you just stand on it yeah, and just haul exactly. balls, dude. Yeah. That would be hilarious to see some dude ripping across the field. Oh, and, you know, the snow's deep, so he doesn't know treads. the waterways. Oh, my coming. God. It just buries him. And, <laughs> and it's all you'd treads, have to do dude, is just get a, get a pair of skis and just get a tiller and take the fucking tiller blade off and just put, like, yeah. a track on it. Yeah. Behind him, go. <laughs> yeah, and make sure you take the shield off the tiller too, because yeah, I mean, what could be dangerous about this? Yeah, Nothing. Sounds like a good plan to me. Yeah, it well, you sorts the, it out. You take the blade off, put a track system on it. Similar yeah. to our view but, on drugs, this situation sorts itself out quickly. It, yeah, it does. He's making sense here, though. He's oh my god, it's like a tre- stand-up treading jet uh, ski, yeah. but like snowmobile. With with treads, man. We'll make have, one already. Know, Quit talking about it. I love it, man. Dude. Episode forty one, Justin's making sense all of a sudden. What is <laughs> I going love it, dude. on in here? <laughs> I love it, dude. You got a, your own stand up fucking treadmill, dude. I like it. That moves you through the uh That's the not forest. a treadmill at all. That's like the It's got treads. Tread. Well, yeah, I mean <laughs> wait, a tread if it was grinding something, it would yeah, be true. a mill with treads. It's a uh, um uh, I, I don't even know, man. It's, it's a tread CNC, man. I don't know. We're just okay. going to call it a Lubeck. Uh, I think so. I think <laughs> snow Shredder. Tire. Tank treads no, on his. The Snow Shredder. Snow Treader. Oh, oh Treader. Yeah. Snow yeah. Treader. Okay. I like this brainstorm. Oh, yeah. See? All right. We eventually get there. Yep. We Somebody's going to see this and make this internet. Winter, yeah. winter will still suck. I want to see it. I want to see it. I want to see it. You want the Snow Treader. Stand behind like a. Basically towing you on skis at a stupid amount of speed. Yep. Oh, dude, It'd get on awesome. YouTube. What are oh, you talking about? <laughs> They've already you want to see this. people getting drugged behind things at ridiculous oh, speeds? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, the I, fucking I meant like surfing when the smile in the and ditches. happiness. You know, oh, not... but they're excited about it? <laughs> yeah. They're fucking wakeboarding in the ditches behind a pickup truck and shit. Yeah. <laughs> like... Oh, yeah, I see that. <laughs> That's awesome. That's a good time. Yeah, I imagine right. it would be. So, I, again, really I like spring. Uh, yeah. Justin's coming up with great business ideas for winter, which no one likes. <laughs> uh, not your ideas. Your ideas are great. The, w- the winter. Um, now, I, I, don't mind I would ask Dale what his favorite season is, but I've no. seen his wardrobe, and just based alone on the amount of... Of sleeveless shirts and sandals. Cable Weibo, bro. Cable oh, Weibo. Right, dog. Yeah. yeah. But I like yeah, spring, What do they call those? The, the full brim hats? Gays. Oh, no. Yeah, um, basically. <laughs> something like that. <laughs> Jealous boot man. Hawaiian yep. shirts and khaki Jimmy Hawaiian Buffett. shirts. Dale's Jimmy Buffett, the Cable Weibo Poop shit, necklace. like Sammy Hagar or yeah. whatever. That's big on beach yeah. style. So before before we get yeah, into one of those beach into guys, yeah, man. oh for sure. Before we it's get it. into how Dale loves summertime and hot weather, uh, I got a story to tell, and this is before I. This is the first encounter I had <laughs> ever had. You know the story. Know the story. First encounter I ever had with Dale, but before I knew Dale. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. like he, it saw, will. he saw me and then started working with me. Well, a couple weeks later. Yeah, like but didn't even realize who I was. Literally two weeks later. So. I'm driving one day and on a road, train tracks, mm-hmm. train crossing. So I'm stopped. This purple Jeep flies up behind me. 
goes into the ditch, passes like six or seven cars just to get to the entrance of the strip mall <laughs> where he pulls into a parking spot, hops out of his Jeep, and walks into the fucking tanning salon. <laughs> wow, dude. <laughs> and I literally looked at my fiance at the time, now wife, and went, you see this homo? <laughs> he was in such a hurry to go tanning. He couldn't wait for the train to end. And two weeks later, I started working with Dale. See, <laughs> and I put it together because there's that purple Jeep. <laughs> but your observations are all wrong. That's awesome. A, it's not that I couldn't wait for the train. It's that I didn't have to. I had a Jeep. It's pointless. I used mm -hmm. to do that all the time. I used to do that on 50 at Midas when traffic was crazy. I would just drive through the ditch out on the right Route 50 instead of waiting in fucking traffic. But it wasn't the ditch that was hilarious. No, it was know, the was ditch tanning. combined but with I the was going... strut into <laughs> the tanning I'm, I'm tan. Set. I'm going tanning. Set. That's, Gary, how you did. that's how you did that time. I, maybe that's not normally how you walk, but that time that's what you were doing. What music was that's he That's how I remember it. What music do you think he listens to while he's tanning? Oh, dude, you, know, you know it was kickstart my heart. Come on, oh, man. Okay, it was fucking okay. Molly Crew at that point. <laughs> yeah, and right into girls, girls, girls. Fucking right. I was, I was going to Cancun. Right. That's why I was tanning. I found that because, out much later, but hilarious yeah, in the moment. I could see that. <laughs> that's pretty gay. So Dale likes Tanny summer. Salon. Nah, it was probably good by Are you guys so you, you guys got a problem with gays now? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Would you no, I got a problem with you being gay. <laughs> hardcore, hardcore. Well, watch your ass, motherfucker. <laughs> I do. <laughs> I yeah. do. Yeah, the rest of them we don't mind. Just the Dale variety. Yeah. No, summer's good, but spring is better because it's the precursor, man. Like after a shitty winter, life starts sprouting again, man. Lead Flowers up. are popping, birds are chirping, mm -hmm. and women start wearing less clothes. Which is why summer is so good, is because hot chicks come out of shorts, hibernation. Mini skirts, tank tops. Yeah, dude. No, they. I'm hot, sorry, but that's just good times. Hot chicks hibernate during the winter. Yeah, they do. I think everyone knows this at yeah. this point. And it, I mean, tell me I'm wrong. Yeah. And then they start to sprout in the spring, and they're in full bloom by summer. I'm sorry, hot dudes, because I'm gay or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we knew what you meant. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I just, <laughs> June, I just by knowing you, I included type. those in as well. Oh, let me take your wife out. I'm gay. It's fine. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We're going bra shopping. <laughs> Before she leaves, I'd be like, oh, listen, there's a potential that you're going to get raped tonight. <laughs> and so you need to be, be, be prepared. Oh, I will, <laughs> only, with, only with permission. <laughs> <laughs> I only rape with permission. Yeah, yeah. Everybody likes to play the rape game now and then, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They like to say no. Oh, no. I don't even know you. <laughs> I don't know. It's just like I would end at Bernie's, right? I would, I would, yeah. I would make it like a. I would tell her it'd be like Liam Neeson and like taking her or whatever. Like you're about to go on a date with a man <laughs> <laughs> who's got a specific. He set dared of me <laughs> because I, I said in a joke that he was gay. <laughs> <laughs> you might get raped that, tonight, so you got to take this in the or arm. Yeah, doing a movie yeah. intro. <laughs> <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger know, in Little Tortilla Boy. <laughs> little Tortilla Boy. <laughs> Who is that? Frank my Caliente? Uh, is that the why movie guy. So little? Yeah, it's the why movie guy. Why are my tortillas so big? <laughs> <laughs> you could say in a movie like, in the world, you know? like Yeah, uh, that guy, dude. Little yeah. boy tortilla. An old married man gets a dare from a man <laughs> who said <laughs> he was gay. <laughs> now... Dude, I'm he must not take gay. his wife out no, to prove that he is. <laughs> the Norm this could says. easily be a Warner Brothers movie, <laughs> dude. Mel Brooks. Yeah, he's still alive. He's really old, dude. Like They're nine, all nine, really he's old. old. He's got a lot of money and he's Jewish, so he's gonna live a long time. There's no new movie stars because no one watches movies anymore. He not, bathes, like they, not like they used to. He no. bathes in the in the blood of of dead children, so. So Although, he's still alive. <laughs> I have I have got turned out of that new Netflix series, Warrior. That shit's good, man. It's Kung Fu meets Old West. Uh, oh, you were meets, telling me. Meets IRA, Irish fucking gang. Like, oh, dude, it's so good. You were telling me. I won't watch it. No, I know you won't. It's not really your thing. But they do the martial arts. Oh, dude, lots of fucking ass kicking. You got the Irish running around kicking ass. You got the cops kicking ass. You got just the whole Old West vibe. Whorehouses and all that. Is it based shit. in the spring or summer? Yeah, that's a good question. Thanks for asking uh, that. It's in fucking California. Oh, they only have one season. 
California is lame, and this is like what's, yeah. the, what's the crazy? only season in California is take away your gun season. Well, that's, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, I hope it's the only, just because of you. I hope it's the only season of that show they put out because you like it. There's three. <laughs> yeah, they've already done. Too late. Though. You suck. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Well, no more. Okay. <laughs> no more. Probably not. Dale likes this. Stop making it. Yep. What I was gonna say is California only has one season, which is funny because that's low on the totem pole of why California sucks is they only have one season. Like there's a whole lot of other reasons first. Well, yeah. I mean, there, there's different, you can get in different seasons in California though. I feel like you just got to drive North. Yeah, yeah, you're right. yeah, I you guess know. that's fair. Mountains. They do have, they do have some winners up there. So you get down, down though. Cause you know, California is like so well, big. Dude. California is very specifically like when people think about it, you know, L.A., Beverly Hills. Summertime. That's what I equate it to. Like You're taking it down in but the southern part. Most of the states, like southern north, Illinois. Dude. Yeah. That's it's where you got Bigfoot. It's just a bunch of rednecks growing weed. Yeah. <laughs> and Bigfoot, dude. That's like all that Pacific Northwest. That is so man. accurate. <laughs> the Emerald Triangle, bro. Yeah. You know, and Bigfoot. You got to be careful people up there. People dying, man. That's a man. lot different. A lot of people got killed up there in the mountains yeah. with the whole marijuana tray back in the day. Yeah. Now from, it's from legal. fucking so. Bigfoot. That's the problem. Yeah, right. It's been... They kill you. Just trying to get his specs. up there. Yeah. They try to kill you, man. So, Justin, how about you? What's your favorite season, bro? See, through my travels yeah. in life, I've become enlightened. So now I appreciate all seasons with for their beauty. Oh, and I'm gay. <laughs> um, no gay. <laughs> no, I, I don't mind. I don't I don't dislike <laughs> any of them, but uh, I don't know. Like I was wrong. Fall's I'm sorry. cool because the colors are pretty, but also I'm a dude. So, I mean, it's like really like summertime, of course. It's like summer's going to be the best. Yeah. You got, you get to go out, you can grill. You don't have to worry too much until like this, when the summer storms come in and fuck shit up for a moment. But oh, I like that. So shit. nice, man. Good summer, summer rain, good summer storm. Fuck yeah, dude. Give yeah. me some thunderstorms. I like that shit. I don't know why. Tornadoes are God's way of population control. I don't worry about that shit. That's yeah. right. I mean, and most of the time, they don't even mess up people, but they do mess up some, like, animals and stuff. So and, I think he's just calling the herd. There. Well, the animals need to have better senses than get the fuck right. out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come to your senses. Get in the barn. Yeah. Pretty much. Most animals. Yeah, they're pretty good at that. So summer, you like summer. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's always fun again, you know, chicks. Yeah. Well, and you also own a Jeep, so. Yeah. Jeep's always fun. I do got to say, California was kind of nice, but, like, you do miss, I, I don't know, I miss the winter being out there because it's like the seasons were just kind of like. Pretty flat. They were like, yeah, it yeah. was pretty monotone. Yeah. It just got really hot or it got, like, cold you'd have a little bit of rain here and there but it was real mild but i'm a subtropical humid guy i think that uh i will definitely be retiring humid. southern georgia northern florida area yeah yeah there's can, plenty of country there myself. left at, least, I, I, at this point in time. you'll be you'll be walking that strut in some tanning salon yeah, somewhere at right. 78 years old i don't old. need a tanning salon in southern georgia yeah when well, you're I'll 78 go dude you're gonna you go strutting in there you're gonna have like this leather saggy skin you have white hair. Oh, yeah. No, no, no problem. Even you're old. I don't care what I look like. You look like a Hulk Hogan, like a shriveled up Hulk Hogan. <laughs> it's just like living it up in the tanning bed. I like, got to say. God, I hope so. In all my life. In 40 no one, years dude, and 30 years or whatever. No one's compared me to Hulk Hogan. Oh, God. No, I, no. on this I hope that happens with everything <laughs> in me, man. Like, oh, we're going to go gonna drive be, down the, and see Dale this I'm, weekend and show up and he looks like the, the fucking hey, what's Hulk up, brothers? Right? What's hey, up, brother? Welcome, welcome down to Georgia, man. <laughs> and I hope like, you wear your boots. You? Oh, I will. And you sweat so much you get fucking foot Damn, rot. Okay. And you yeah. have to get your feet amputated, you son of a bitch. Wow. <laughs> See, I didn't mean it like that. I meant How just like a put skin that tone. Kind of evil on me, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> I was going for comedy. You want pain. Well, pain's fucking funny, dude. That is. Did anybody ever see anybody get kicked in the balls and not giggle a little? That's true. I mean, there's a whole show called Ouch My Ball. I'll just have boots like sitting on my wheelchair, like at the bottom. I'll just put my nuts <laughs> in. Just so I'm like, ha, bitch, I still wear boots. 
boots. Just wear boots on your like, nubs. You know what would be the best? The canal. Yep. You know what would be even better is get like formaldehyde jars that fit in there with your feet that could have been amputated in there. So when people were like, oh, man, you have no feet, be like, nope, they're right in here. See? <laughs> just shake them up. <laughs> <laughs> this is big toe floating. Nice. Well, it fell apart a little, but he's there. <laughs> he's there. In 20 years. <laughs> Aaron, how about you? Well... I probably have to say basil. No, <laughs> I'm no. I'd have to say you're probably hanging. Out I really there. don't know, man. I mean, I just uh, nothing okay. you've ever thought about before. It's just eh, whatever it is. No, I don't think, man. So that's a problem. No. <laughs> it requires movement of electrons. Do, do I? Is there a particular <laughs> yeah, like, season that I that I you know? You know, uh, I don't know, man. Is, is there one? It'd be summer, though. Okay. I'm just giving you a cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> I was on the edge of my yeah, time. Everyone yeah, was. I, I, was. I was like, is he going to come up with ridiculous. it? But I would say summer is probably my favorite overall. Not for, you know, the the uh, Caribbean kind of thing like Dale does. Oh, but, dude, I'm going to tell yeah. you what. I'm gonna buy you a fucking couple Hawaiian shirts and a pair of flip flops, and just 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 run that for about three months, and let me know. Let me know if I don't change your mind a little bit. It's really nice. I'm locked. <laughs> I'm you, over forty, soon dude. That, <laughs> soon as that Hawaiian silk hits your skin, <laughs> yeah. Hawaiian silk. Uh, yeah. Your your silk. your, your chest silk. starts. You know, you start sweating just oil out of your you know chest. You know why I started wearing Hawaiian shirts? Gold chains. I just will figured appear. if it's a Hawaiian shirt, it has to be authentic Hawaiian. Yeah, I, I want a, a Hawaiian slave make the shirt. <laughs> I don't know if there are Hawaiian slaves uh, anymore, but maybe. But the thing the about the place people, the thing about Hawaiian. the Hawaiian shirts is, I, I was always a tank Sorry. top guy. But the problem is, my shoulders get fried because you're out in the sun all day. But with a Hawaiian shirt, you can just unbutton, you leave the shirt open. Get nice cool breeze, all that, but your shoulders are covered, so you don't get yeah, I understand. I'd be surprised if you've ever buttoned one of them. It's, that would be more of a surprise. I usually button them up one time and then just rip them open. Yeah. yeah like when it gets warm. <laughs> 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 That's how you know it's noon. Are you kidding? Dale has an entire bag of fresh ones the same way. <laughs> yeah. So everywhere yeah. he goes and he's Dude. like, I mean, rips come on. it open at the pool. Let us swim. <laughs> yeah. That's probably I'll not have on a camera. Mojito. <laughs> Hold on, let me get my shirt and mojito. Oh, just, look, mojito. just look over there, dude. Look I over there. I haven't had a mojito in a while, so by, there's by mojitos many, coming you soon. You think these are a lot of black t-shirts? He's, you know, if you can't, you're not gonna see this on camera, but there's totes and totes of t-shirts over there. <laughs> yep. On the other side of the wall, there's like triple times that of the same Hawaiian shirt. Yeah. <laughs> just, just thousands Dang. of them, dude. Yep. Yep. Just. There's got to be what, five, six totes there, and a couple boxes just jammed with t-shirts. Yep. The only thing that sucks Those are the about, t-shirts that go under his Hawaiian shirt. The only thing that sucks about Hawaiian shirts is when you're wearing Hawaiian shirts and you're hanging out at the beach, you're getting drunk. That's right. And you're gonna yeah. ruin your fucking shirt. What do you do in the oh, winter though? And that's, I was waiting for the bad part about this, but you're gonna ruin, you ruin your shirt. You ruin the shirts. Okay. What do I do in the winter? Yeah, you just wear the. Hide. Wear the uh, same, same shirt in the it. winter? Come on. I wear Hawaiian shirts under my pullovers. There you go. <laughs> you think he wears the t-shirts underneath his Hawaiian shirts that have, like, the abs drawn on them? And shit? <laughs> yeah. I would need to. Yeah. So that's, yeah. what he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good idea. I, I like that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like one of those like one of those, uh, those tight shirts, you know? I'll get it painted on. But like it's, like, it's like a dude that's not wearing a shirt. Abs, Skin yeah, tight. Too many, too many abs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. Like AI drew those ass. He's starting to look like a caterpillar. He's like yeah. a fucking caterpillar. It looks like corn on the cob, no dude. Pack, <laughs> it looks like a it looks like a section of corn on the cob. <laughs> yeah, it would too. <laughs> he go, he go, ha ha. You know, man. He go like he got corn on the cob, ha ha. He's got that corn on the cob stomach yeah. going on. Make it real loud. Yeah. So I mean, in closing, guys, I think we can all agree, winter sucks. I'm kind of glad yeah. this one's over. Yeah, I'm done with it. Yeah, I don't know whose Winter's idea this was to over. do seasons. It's You're not over. Crazy. If we don't have it's an over. ice storm one more time, I'm I'm gonna be surprised. Dude, 
It's, it's Illinois, man. I want it's one. Fe- I want one just, more. It's just now. Hardcore. Storm. Although I will say, I do love just for the pure reaction and of beware it. Beware the Ides of March. It's like say. the first time we get a nice day every year. I walk around and tell as many people as I can that I'm sick of this hot weather. I can't wait for yeah, winter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're doing that. <laughs> yeah, that's usually the first thing I say. Yeah, yeah. The the at the the second that I'm inconvenienced by the weather, I'm like, I'm done with yep, summer. Done. Dude. I'm over it. Well, Ready and- for winter. And there's a there's a difference between ideal temperature. You were saying earlier, you know, seventy to seventy five degrees. I would say seventy five to eighty for me. That's where I really like it to be. Yeah. But that's on a day off. When you're fucking working. Oh yeah. Physical yeah. labor. Oh, give me sixty five. Sixty to sixty five yep. is about the perfect fucking working. See, temperature. I I go by where I live. You know, usually what when I get older, I'm gonna go by the ball theory. You know what I mean? Wherever I I whatever climate I end up going to, you have to find it at what perfect level your old balls will shrivel up or down <laughs> okay. to. And once you find that, that comfortable level, you know, and you're like, you know, you're in your upper 60s, man, you know? So you got to get in that right. So it's like you're ballsing too, you know, down to your yeah, knees. No, you know yeah, that's like, at around 90 degrees, the nut starts to stick to the inside of yeah. your thighs. Now this would yeah. be like, you know, that's what you I hate do. to steal well, catchphrases here, but oh my God, I've got a great idea. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what if we make a thermometer... But like in the th- like it's it's the thing Ball floats monitor. up and down. It's a ball sack inside of it. You put it out and it shows how far your balls would hang that day based on the temperature That's outside. That's a really good idea. I know. That's all I come up with. <laughs> dude, how much? And dude, dude, how much? And if it is going to be too hot, you come up like you know the camel packs, right? Like you have mm-hmm. water in. Well, we just make the camel sack, and it's just like cooling tubes that hold your balls. So. It, Keeps them yeah. in the perfect time. I was thinking to scrote them on your back full of water, but okay. Yeah. Basically. People would buy that shit. People would put it on yeah. their truck. People would put it on their <laughs> you gotta truck. You got to get temperature controlled underwear. You know? <laughs> temperature controlled underwear. Yeah, but I fans mean, down there could I'm be not, dangerous. I'm not plugging in my underwear, man. <laughs> it's not... No, no, no. It's just you <laughs> wear a, a pack USB that port, dude, cool water. That oh, okay. you could plug it into your car. The camel sack. You plug it in there. Hold on a second. <laughs> I got to plug in my temperature my controls in. underwear. Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah. Lord Jesus. It starts sparking. <laughs> every Fire time. It, Jesus. it blows oh, the fuse gosh, every time fire. I plug it in. You're, 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 God damn it. Burn your dick and your balls off, man. He's like, right. plugged it in. Everything starts I popping think, and sparking. I don't think there's anything else to talk about. We've already covered electrocuting your car balls. Car starts on oh, fire. I think we're there, guys. Burnt. I mean. You burn to death in your electric car. Because your USB overheated on your temperature controlled underwear. Although I will that's, give a uh, that's the worst season. Yep, that you could have a subtle nod to fall due to Halloween, and I think we can all agree again for the same reason as summer is nice. Chicks and oh, slutty costumes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but the weather always sucks on Halloween. It does too. Yeah, it's but it's always shit. Still slutty guys. And then Christmas is coming, and I fucking hate Christmas. That we've already done that. So. <laughs> we, yeah, we, we got a few more months before we got to worry Fuck about Christmas. Our next Yay, Christmas Christmas summer episode. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's pretty soon. I think we need to take a vote and move Christmas to July. I think you're on your just mind. so we can ruin summer for Dale. They already, yeah. <laughs> they already that would ruin. Okay, but second Christmas because I kind of like Christmas shit. where it's at. We just do second Christmas and yeah, Christmas in July. Who doesn't want Christmas twice a year? <laughs> No, he doesn't. He doesn't want it once. No, that's true. <laughs> that would double Jesus' age. Yeah. Well, you are now. Yeah. You are I'm going to get me started on leap year, babies. And so with that. Oh, my God. I'm only like seven. <laughs> yeah. If you guys made it this far, leave a comment down yeah. below. Let us know what your favorite season is and reasons why or why not. And we Spring, will see you summer, on the next winter. episode. Truck. My damn old pickup truck and my dog. Who hit my wife? <laughs>